morning session went really well. We had a good, good squad of eight. We, I believe, we won all our games. Um, so passing's good. Now I'm excited to go on 11-11. So we see how how that goes. I drove down from Walla Walla. It's about four hours. So it wasn't too bad. I have some friends, so I didn't have to pay for for this day in Portland. So that's that's great. I'm just excited to be here. Though. Playing background is mostly collegiate. I played for Walla Walla Wolves, Walla Walla University. Played a couple of years there, and then I've, I've done some club work over in Walla Walla, some minor clubs. So. I'm hoping to show my agility, speed, and quick judgments, which is most, mostly what I have here. So make those quick passes, make sure we, we play the ball well, and come up with the win. Uh, actually, my coach for St. Mary's uh, knew Amos, and he uh, suggested that I try out for the Portland Timbers. And uh, got here, thought about driving, but decided to take a plane instead. Didn't want to risk uh, getting the pass closed down. So uh, I think I showed the coaches that I was fit, um, that I play quickly, uh, got good touches out of the back, and uh, got a lot of pace. Hopefully that's good enough. Uh, I think bodies are going to be a little sore, so I'm going to try to take advantage of uh, the fact that I'm probably more fit than uh, the majority of the players out here. I'd really like to get an opportunity to play for uh, the Portland Timbers when they enter the 2011 MLS game. We, uh, we started the, t the day's session with eight aside, um, a lot of games, a lot of play for the, for the players. We get a sense of what they can do and it becomes a, uh, a real chance for us to familiarize ourselves with the players and get to see who we think are going to be the better players going into the 11-11 game. Uh, it got a little ragged at, at the end of each game, but the, you know, the first half, the first, uh, say half and beginning of the second half tends to be a good level. Guys are excited, um, to play full field and, and, uh, they start to familiarize themselves with their teammates. And we saw some good goals, some good defensive plays. Uh, the fitness isn't where it needs to be and it tends to break down at the end of each, uh, each game, but, you know, we expect that a little bit in the off season, but, Players, I think, who are fit and and, and uh, you know good sort of professionals tend to stand out as the day progresses. Well, we'll see how some of the bodies hold up with uh, with guys coming into their second day of, of significant soccer at a high level. Um, but I'm hopeful that we have three or four guys here that are starting to separate themselves from some of the other players, and I think are doing a pretty good job with it. So we'll see uh, how they do in day two, but we're hopeful that they'll do well, and and then we'll see where we go from there. Yeah. 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 Yeah.